I just got super excited. Oh my God, I see two now. <sighs> two giant antlers. season and I just got one hey folks May 1st and I'm up where I was early January and uh, it's late late afternoon almost dark scurried on up here after work I'm gonna spend a couple days up here um, this uh, scrape right here excited me there's another one way up there and there's some smaller ones over here and as I was walking over to, to this small one, I saw a, an older shed. Not a brownie, I don't believe. I haven't got up to it yet, but this particular one is an old one. And we'll see just how old it is. It's been chewed on hard. Let me see it. Definitely last year's. Definitely. But I'm dropping it right near other rubs around here. So I'm real excited about this, this area. I've got a lot of thick stuff to, to check in here. It's going to take me the rest of the evening. And if I see anything else, I will turn us back on. Talk to you later. Still in the area where I found that old horn antler. Just want to show you how, what these moose have been into. All these blowdowns and in between these stumps and everything else. There's moose crap everywhere in here. I mean, it's all over the ground. And there's some older stuff and some newer stuff. So they've been in here all winter. There's a stream. Oh, probably 200 yards that way that I was in probably early April and there was so much snow in here, but that, that stream was surrounded by moose sign everywhere. I didn't see a lot of rubs over there, so I'm, I'm going to hunt, hunt there tomorrow, but um, I'll take a walk through there anyway, but I think I am just looking for rubs. That's where the action is. We'll keep you informed. Almost stepped on this one. Just headed back to the truck. It is getting dark. And this guy. There's another old one. Two old ones this afternoon. On the way out. It chewed up pretty good there. Definitely a coyote or something there. Wait, I'll keep looking on the way out. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> that might be the match to it. Holy cow. I think it is. Look at that. I believe that's a match. For sure. All chewed up though. That's alright. Cool. I like it. Three antlers for the ride back to the camper. Hey guys, we're back on May 2nd. I'm in the same area. I was probably 150, 200 yards across a little stream down in there like I said I was going to come down into. And uh, I just got super excited. Oh my God, I see two now. <sighs> two giant antlers right there oh my god this is so awesome oh my god let's walk to him just saw him i'll take care of uh, zoom 
Oh, oh my God, beautiful. I just saw some rubs near the stream. And I said, there's gotta be antlers around here. There's crap everywhere. Oh my gosh, look at them. Holy cow. Oh. It's the same, it's the same moose. It's gotta be the same moose that I found. That's something I gotta tell you too. When I took those two, two sheds that I, uh, oh, the three sheds I found yesterday, but the two smaller ones was the same as the other one, just a different year. And so was that. That's this year's moose. I've got three years in a row of this same moose. <laughs> Let's look at them. Oh, boys, there's another one right there. Another shed. Holy cow. Three sheds in one place. This is an old one, too. Holy cow. Look at that. <laughs> three sheds. I've never done that before. That is a first. That is a first. Wow. What an exciting. Ooh, I get some stuff to pack out. One more. Okay. There's that one. Look at the face on that thing. Holy cow, look at that. Wow. Look at that. This guy doesn't drop them far apart, that's for sure. Oh, how lucky. Oh, man. Look at that knob right there. Holy cow. They aren't even chewed. Except for this little guy here. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, I'm so excited. Whew. May 2nd, there's still snow in the woods. Not much though. It's early in the morning, it's like uh, 7.30, 8 o'clock. I've been in here for an hour or so. Whew, we'll keep it going. Motivation, love it. I just made it back to my truck. It's uh, quarter of nine in the morning. May 2nd, second day. There are three years of the same moose there, except for that far left one. But those are three years in a row. Of course, the biggest being the, the last, which is how you would want it, I guess. But beautiful, beautiful start on the second day. Hey guys, I'm in a different area different road altogether took me a while to get out with that i don't know how much that pack weighed but <laughs> it was heavy but i come into a different spot saw some big uh, rubs and started walking around and just like it's supposed to happen there's another antler this one i don't know kind of looks like a fresh one but it's a small one It is a fresh one. Another three-pointer. Boy, this year and my three-pointers. <laughs> Crazy. But we will take it. I don't have much battery in my phone here, so... There she be. We'll be packing that one out as well. Just a little note here about what the moose is doing. You can see... There's a rub on this side. And there's nothing on this side. Chances are that means that one side is already gone. And he's trying like heck to get that other side off. Another old one. Another real old one. Yeah, you're too old. 
cool. Boy, so certainly find a lot of old ones here. Another old one. Chewed up for sure. Yeah. I was in here on sled earlier, I'm sure I ran up with that one. I don't know it's still on the ground, but pretty cool. We've got to get you people out here in the woods and clean up these uh, sheds. <laughs> Look. <laughs> so many old sheds I'm finding. Look at that guy. Thinks he's an elk. <laughs> They're cool. But where are all the brown ones? <laughs>